Chris, thank you. New tonight, a local learning center's director has stepped down and it needs to quickly find a replacement. If it doesn't, parents could soon be left scrambling to find a different child care option. TV 5's James Felton takes a closer look at the issue in Swan Valley. They would be devastated, for sure. Lonnie Kubik wiping away tears as she worries about families who may lose child care soon. Kubik is the assistant director at the Swan Valley Learning Center. Swan Valley Schools Superintendent Matt McRae says the state could close the SVLC by the end of the month if a new director with proper credentials isn't found soon. The SVLC has been without a director since September 26th. As we said, Kubik is the assistant director. But she says moving to director is not in the cards for her. I would love to, but I don't have the credentials um, to take the position. And even further than that, um, it would leave with it would mean me leaving um, teaching and I don't want to leave teaching. The SVLC serves dozens of families and over 150 children. That includes three and four year old preschool, three and four year old daycare and before and after school programs for children up to 12. Most of our kids come from all day care kids, families that are working, parents that work nonstop. So yes, I mean, we are needed here. Sometimes we're the only stable thing in their life. You know, they see us every day, um, five days a week. So if you have the qualifications to be the next director of the SVLC, Swan Valley Schools wants to hear from you. We have a really good team in place, small enough um, to um, easy enough to work with. Um, we've always been kind of a family here because we're here, we see each other more than we do our family sometimes. So um, just apply um, and want to be part of our family. Reporting in Saginaw County, James Felton, WNEM, TV5.